Welcome to Manifested Publishers. Hi, my lovely learners. I am so excited to have you again on this platform. Remember, this is Manifested e-learning platform, and I am Teacher Purity. So we are going to learn hygiene and nutrition activities for grade 3, and we are starting on a new topic about the use of improvised materials for cleaning utensils. Under the use of improvised materials for cleaning utensils, we shall start by learning the types of dirt that are found on utensils. So, welcome to the lesson and hope that you are going to enjoy. Now, types of dirt that are found on utensils. Utensils are the things we use at home to serve and uh, cook food. So remember when you cook from a sufuria and also serve your food from a plate, they get dirty. So we want to see the types of dirt that are found on utensils. Now we clean utensils at home to keep away germs. Germs can cause diseases and uh, can make us to fall sick. So we clean utensils at home. So we clean utensils at home to keep away germs. Remember, germs are not good for our health. When you serve your food from a dirty plate, you can become sick. We also wash utensils or clean utensils at home to keep away pests such as cockroaches. We clean utensils. To keep away, to keep away cockroaches. We clean utensils to keep away cockroaches. Dirty utensils attract cockroaches. No, so now that is the reason why we clean utensils at home. First, to keep away germs, and second, to to keep away pests like cockroaches. So, what are some of the types of dirt that are found on? Utensils. So types of dirt. The first type of dirt that found on utensils, you can have milk dirt. Milk dirt is the first one. Now milk dirt includes the dirt, maybe that a cup you, that you've used to drink your tea or even Yogurt. So milk dirt is a type of dirt found on utensils. Then we have another one. We call it grease. Grease dirt. Now grease dirt includes dirt that has come from oily foods like meat or fish or eggs. So grease dirt looks oily. Then we have the last one, we call it starch dirt. Starch dirt. Starch dirt is the remains of food that remain on a plate. We call them starch dirt. So these are the main types of dirt that are found on utensils. The first one is a milk dirt. Now, this is an example of milk dirt. This cup was used to drink tea and therefore there are remains of, of the tea. So this one is milk dirt. Then we have grease dirt. Grease dirt is the dirt that remains on plates or utensils that you've used either to, to serve meat or fish or eggs. Then we have lastly starch dirt. So starch dirt is the remains of food that remain on a plate after you've eaten. So this is an example of starch dirt. You can see there are remains of food on the plate. We call them starch dirt. So these are the main three types of dirt that are found on utensils. The first one, we have milk dirt. Then we have grease dirt. And lastly, starch that milk that is when we have used a utensil to serve milky foods then grease that is the the remains of oily foods like the fish fried eggs 
or meat. And lastly, we have starch dirt. These are the main types of utensils that are found, the, of dirt that are found on utensils at home. And we are supposed to clean our utensils every day. Remember to keep away germs and also to keep away pests like cockroaches. So back at home, I want you to visit your kitchen, check where the dirty utensils have been placed, and try to identify the three types of dirt, the milk dirt, grease dirt, and the starch dirt. Meanwhile, I'll give you some work for you to copy. Get ready with your exercise book, pencil, and rubber. The question, write down three types of dirt found on utensils. You will write the three types of dirt found on utensils. Fill your answers in blank space number one, two, and three. Then make sure that you are going through your work after you have completed it. So hope to see you in the next lesson and thank you for attending the lesson. <laughs>